Hello everyone, Realmfire here. Welcome to a new Minecraft video. Uh, hold on. Ah, I guess the audio's not coming through my computer. At least not on the mixer. But, uh, I've got a bit done. Now this was here for the last video. These banners. And, yeah, I didn't do anything in here. I've been working around the outside of the base. Not outside of the base. I've been working around, like, other areas. Um. First I have to remember what I did to show off. I think I got that over there a bit taller. I'm not entirely sure how, how it looked at the last video. Because I've done a lot of more mining. And also built this. Very little progress has gotten done between videos. Sorry, I was just taking a drink. So I did this here. I might change this out for, like, oak. Let me go down here. I've got to show something big happened. Um, I, like, expanded this area a bit. Got that down to Y19 because I didn't have the ladder to go down to Y12. And then I've been working around here, trying to lower it. As you can see here, I just did that with that. So, that's a very easy to fall off of platform. But I also am throwing a bunch of the resources I got from doing that in my chest. So yeah. I don't really have an agenda for today's video, as far as I'm aware yet. And I don't have much of a resource stockpile anymore. So, I think today's video, I'm just gonna grab some food, put my stuff in chest. Also, um, I actually should show this part off. I got, I made myself a new set of armor. I'm gonna just quickly move this. I can't change, I can't move that. I don't know how it got stuck there, but I, I'm not going to spend time to find out, and that's going to irk me. Probably irk a lot of people, too. I also just realized I'm running low on arrows. Hmm. And it's not a wood issue, it's a uh, feather issue. Genuinely, I thought I had a whole bunch of feathers, but I guess not. Oh, uh, whatever, one of my future plans is going to be make a chicken farm. I should have in here quite a few baked potatoes. I'm actually just gonna hold off until night passes before beginning my expedition. Of course it's gonna rain. Got some building blocks, got some... Got a variety of foods now. I'm gonna leave all those in there for when I actually need them. But before I go, I best make a new axe. Where did I leave my sticks? I thought I had a whole bunch of them. I'm probably being blind. Oh no, I ran out of uh, sticks when I did that. The uh... Making a massive number of pickaxes to use in the mines. Side note, I'm running low on iron, which is not a good thing at all. What I what I make? Oh, 
but I don't know what I made. Unless I made a new pick. I might have just made a new pick. I thought I made a new act. I don't even remember what I just did. That's not a good thing. Luckily, in one of these chests, there should be iron. No? No? Did I just... Okay. That's kind of embarrassing. In retrospect, I should have been up. Okay, um, I'm kind of tired, aren't I? Round number three. There we go, I have an axe again. I'm going to go down to my building base before I head on this expedition. And also I'm going to... Not that one. Not that one. Yep. F3 and screenshot. Because, you know, I'm likely going to forget the coordinates of my base. But next off, I'm going to this base for a reason. I've gone on a couple adventures so far. I figure today will be another expedition. You can see I have raw iron in here. And actual iron. I'm actually going to just take that back there. I should have a crafting table right over there. And is there anything in there? Yep, there's steak. Uh, Alright, let's just check and see if what I do have in these chests. Real quick, I have a lot of random stuff in these chests. From a lot of my random time here. And also, I have all the sheep. That's it. I have the sheep farm now. I'll I'll deal with that when I get back. Oh no! I also have another idea for something I need to make. Now, I had planks in one of these chests, right? No. Oh. I need a small tree. This is my, like, tree farm for getting wood for my current project. So a lot of stuff from here goes right into the chests in that little incomplete hut. This area will probably all get turned into like cobblestone or paths and paths and all that. Like you know, this is going to be a housing district or shop district probably because this is right by where there's a harbor. First off, it will always be useful to have planks and a crafting bench and a boat, of course. So where is the spare crafting bench? It's in this one. Yep, I. You know, I dumped out a lot of my inventory for this quest, and it's already getting really full again. That's just how it goes, I guess. I need, like, better equipment, so next time I go back into the nether for supplies, I'm going to seriously begin looking at getting the stuff to begin finding 
the fortress, so that I, the, the end fortress thingy, so that I can find my way to the end. Now, of course, this also means I'm going to be increasing my mines to find diamonds. I saw something this way. Alright, so there's a little portion of ruins over here. Objective. Find out where the chest is. Right, as I find the chest. Up we go. All right. Whoa, there's like an underwater arch over here. I saw that. I'm not, the closer I get, it disappears, but from a certain distance, I could see it. Now, something I saw the other day when, when messing around was that there was, a land feature. Oh, is that glow squid? That is a glow squid. Huh. None of these are new ch chunks, I don't think. Plus 1.18 comes out in like a week and a half now. <gasps> oh, this is a new chunk. Alright, uh, let me grab my boat. This is the geode. That's the geode. Um, come on, come on, get to the get to the boat. I say a new chunk. It's been like almost a year since one point seventeen dropped, but you know, a bit more that way. Use the use the glow squid as a reference. I think if I can see the glow squid. Oh, this is no good. Bad things are about to come out. So, idea, idea, idea. I gotta get to land, of course. I'll remember that since it's here. Now, this is probably gonna be important having found new chunks. Because this means I can get 
I begin technologically advancing. There we go. I would like to do the audio bug out for a moment. No, no, don't tell me I lost it when I looked away. It's over here. What I should have done, and what I'm going to hate myself for having not done, is I should have attempted to... There's a shipwreck right there, too. I just saw that. Oh, uh, hello. Yeah, guys, I'm intelligent. Let me just block that up. But that over there is budding amethyst, meaning amethyst crystals will grow on it, right? No. No. Do I have to have a special... I shouldn't do that. I have the wrong tool to break those blocks. What is this material again? Smooth basalt. So it's not something that I would have to struggle to find. Feathers, finally. No, 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 no. That's too deep for me to get to normally. So here's what I'm going to do. Screenshot and move. So that when I do have the resources, like... Uh, I can't remember what helmet it is. Well, what enchantment it is that you put onto the helmet to, uh, to let you breathe underwater. Aqua Affinity, actually. That might be the name. Well, I have an Aqua Affinity helmet, because I am working on my enchanting room now. I'll definitely try and uh, come back here. But also something I think I noticed was a bit of a glow around there. I'm not sure what it could be from. Is that what I think it is? Copper! Yes! Okay, never mind. I'm probably going to be here for a bit. Rise! Oh, 
right. So, I'm pretty sure there might be more copper there. But, I don't have the right helmet to breathe underwater. I'm using an old set of armor, one that has served me well throughout a good chunk of the series now. Before I do a stupid thing, I should probably place my bed. But, you know, wouldn't be adventuring without a risk, would it? Come on. Oh. Alright. Not much to it. I might well I might do some adventuring on the ground, I guess. I had a saddle in case I decided to go on a horseback ride in adventure instead of a normal one. And Well Deserve a screenshot. But yeah. I found a ravine. But it appears that that part of the ravine has nothing. Or this part over here might have something useful to me. Please have copper. Oh! Oh! This is a weird... Okay. Hello, Glow Squid. So, a normal ravine spawned going through an underground ravine, or vice versa. Sorry, a normal ravine spawned going through an underwater ravine, or vice versa. And I also saw that this one was a double underwater ravine. Could it go to triple? No. For safety, I'm not going down there yet. But I do see copper right here. So. Idea. Idea. Stupid idea, but idea. A lot of my ideas tend to be stupid. But are they stupid if they truly work out in the end? Sorry, are they truly stupid if they work out in the end? So, this. Here we go. Nice little breathing hole. Slash secondary access right above the second ravine. Oh, this, this one's a normal ravine. Oh, and there's a skelly down there. No, oh, no, no, no. I almost got trapped down here. Okay, anyways. Uh, that is going to be it for this video, and I will see you all next time.